Hello and welcome to a new video. Today we're gonna do something uh, interesting and also uh, different. We're gonna combine Postman with uh, Google API and also with uh, YouTube. So stay tuned and enjoy. Okay, let's begin. First you navigate to the link in the description, you get to this overview of the Google API and then you go to get a key because you need an API key. You need to enter a custom search API or a name for your project. Yeah, no underscore is valid, so you need only letters. Okay, we're gonna go with uh, search YouTube. It's gonna take a few seconds until the key is generated. Please uh, note your key somewhere or save it somewhere so you can use it in the requests. Okay, then you need to go to um, using REST. There's also an example here. Before you start, you can also have a look at the introduction if you really want. Well, we'll just skip this and just move to um, using the request already. So um, let's move. Uh, you have three parameters, API key, custom search engine and search query. And also you have an example. For the custom search engine, you need to go to Google's search engine and define your own. This search engine uh, is the domain in which you want to search. For this example, we're going to go with YouTube because I'm going to create a request in Postman and I'm going to search in YouTube for my channel for QA guy. So as you can already see, I've created my um, YouTube search engine and then I just copy this key and then I will use it in the example request that I will show you in just a second. Okay, let's move to Postman, create a new collection, Google search or Google YouTube, whatever you want to call it, then create a new request. Okay, um, pretty straightforward, naming convention is whatever you want it to be. Okay. Um, for this example, you can uh, see, as you can already see, if you paste the example they gave you, you already have all the parameters set here, the API key, the custom search engine and the search query. Search query meaning the words that you're using, that you're looking for. In this case, we're going to use the search engine that I defined, which is youtube.com, the domain where you want to search. I'm going to replace the API key with my own API key and for the uh, search word I'm going to go with QA guy. Okay. As you can already see, success uh, status 200 on my um, search. Okay, and then um, if you look below, you're going to see all the details of the query that we just did and the context, which is YouTube in this case. And then we're going to go to items because items is the results of the search. So we have a custom search and result. And as you can already see, um, the link that popped up, you can see the title and the description is the default that I have for QA guy channel. So you see, it was really easy. You just generate your own key. You define your search engine where you want to search and then just uh, enter your keyword that you want.